Hello everyone, welcome to week 7. Previously in week 5 before the midterm, we started talking about OLG models, which is stand for Overlapping Generation Economy. We also described the outcome of this uh, economy when there is no money. So basically each generation, they're going to eat all the bananas they have when they are young. And when they are old, they are starving. As a result, the lifetime happiness of each generation is CDN times CY, which is Y times zero or zero. So um, put it intuitively, the young are eating too many bananas, they are stuffed. The old are not eating enough bananas, they are starving. So every generation is not particularly happy. If somehow they can transfer some of the bananas they have from young to when they are old, then or saving for retirement, then their life can be better. So this week we're going to add or introduce money to the OLG model. And we're going to characterize the equilibrium outcome uh, with money. And as you can see later on that with money, we're able to achieve some kind of a saving so that the consumption in when young becomes Y over 2 and the consumption when old becomes Y over 2 as well. So we're basically able to achieve a perfectly balanced consumption pattern. 